What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Marshall in the conference title game and ended up winning big, 56-35. to 35. Uh, Marshall was like in a three-team race for that first spot. And you can look by their record, 6-6. Six and six. That division didn't do all that well. And, of course, we're having just a magical season at 13 and 0, number two in the country. And for those of you who stayed to the end of the video, we found out what happened with Oklahoma. If you go over to the weekly schedule, Oklahoma is the team we are looking at. We essentially needed them to lose in order to have a really good chance to get in that national championship game. But they beat number 10 Colorado in overtime, which probably means they will go ahead of us in that number two spot in the BCS rankings. But we're going to know for sure right now exactly where we are going to be. So let's go ahead and sim the week. And cross your fingers. I'm not going to speed this up or anything. I don't want this thing to... Well, I can go ahead and try that. Let's do something like this. I forgot. It should bring up something. I forgot what comes up first. I think it's just what bowl you're in. All right. It's going to bring up the awards first. So we won the Coach of the Year Award. That's really cool to see. We will definitely accept that. Looks like Larry Williams won the Doak Walker Running Back Award. Very deserving. Had a killer season. And he's just a sophomore, which is just insane. And, oh my gosh, we're playing in the national title game. How in the world do we sneak in there? Um. Oh my gosh. Uh, let me think. Uh, okay, I just wasn't expecting this. Wow, we got in the title game. How? I thought Oklahoma was going to sneak in, but no, they put us ahead of them. How about that? All right, let's go to the Heisman Trophy ceremony. We may win another big award here. We'll see what's going to happen. Very good chance. I think Williams is going to win it. He had a killer game in that conference title game. I hope that'll cement his status. Thank you all for being here. Tonight, we'll find out who wins the most prestigious award in Brom college football, and Sanchez. the Heisman Trophy. It's an honor Hefner. to present this award, which goes to the best quarterback. college football player in the country. Big Larry this Williams and the fifth spot goes NCAA to Aaron Stuckey, the true freshman quarterback. Who's going to win it? My bet is on Ladies Williams. Cross your fingers. Hopefully he wins it. Congratulations. Ah, how about that? That's awesome. Wow. So, okay, this is going to be really weird. I don't know what to... Okay, I'm just trying to wrap my head around what I'm fixing to go through. I just didn't expect that. Because, okay, so there he is when he won the Heisman Trophy. And Williams and Stucky both won and two. I'm trying to think the last time I've done that. I'm really surprised that happened because, yes, both of them had really good seasons. But I just, we're in a smaller conference. I'm just shocked. Was there literally nobody else in the Power Five that could do what we did in the backfield? I guess not. Either way, it's simply incredible. All right, so we are going to take on... Number one Michigan in the national championship game. So I don't know what this means. If I end up winning the national title today, I don't know what that means for the dynasty. Like, we're going to win it. Does that mean I need to keep going? It's just, but am I going to get stuck in the Conference USA? I, um, I, I don't know what to do about that. We will figure that out at the end uh, of the video when you guys can comment all about that. But either way, we got to take on Michigan. Uh, they are a West Coast offense, arguably the best team in the country. As you can tell by their stats, they are doing great at everything. B-plus overall offense, defense, they're just a whole lot better than we are. Uh, but we will put that to the test. Hopefully we can take care of business today and somehow win a national title, which, again, just makes no sense. I can't. I don't remember the last time I played for a national title with a group of five school. Like, it's been years. I'm just trying to think. I, I don't know if I've ever done it. I think I have, maybe. Maybe it's a first time for everything. Okay, let's recollect our thoughts. And, of course, Williams makes the cover of Sports Illustrated. We're done with recruiting. we got four guys coming in next year. All defensive guys, really excited about that. Let's go to Sports Illustrated. So the bowl rankings. We barely squeaked by Oklahoma. They didn't move up at all, which really shocks me. I figure beating a number 10 team in the country would boost them up, would help them. But it didn't. We stayed above them in the media poll and in the coaches poll. But the computer poll, Oklahoma's a little bit ahead of us, but it doesn't matter. That's by far the closest I've ever seen a number two and a number three fight for that number two spot. 
just insane. I, I just don't know what to think about it. Okay, let's go. Uh, we've already looked at the Heisman winner. I want to look at the other award winners. Uh, the Maxwell Award went to Brian Braun with Williams finishing fifth, and I guess Stucky uh, uh, ended up finishing ninth. And before we do that, let me go over to the Heisman winner. I want to check out the overall stats for these couple of our players. Larry Williams, 1,378 yards, 25 touchdowns, 295 yards, and four touchdowns on top of that. You, that's just a ton of touchdowns for a halfback across the board. So it makes sense that he went in. Like I said earlier, he had 200 yards on the ground and 76 yards through uh, receiving. Just an, a magical game for him. There, there's no better way you could play better heading into that Heisman ceremony. Then you got Stucky. Ended up with 3,000 yards, 36 total touchdowns. And in that last game, he played excellent as well. Four total touchdowns. Just absolutely killer. All right, let's go back to the awards real quick. We'll go here. Uh, so, Braum won the Maxwell, the Bigneric. Looks like Stamper finished six, but a kid from Virginia, middle linebacker, won it. Quarterback with the Braum again. Uh, Walker Williams, of course, the best wide receiver. We didn't have anybody on this list. We've kind of split the, the reps for that one. But a kid out of BYU won it. Tied in the same thing. Uh, Martellus Bennett, if anybody remembers him playing back in the day. And offensive line, we didn't have anybody on this list as well. Uh, the Remington, same here. Uh, Lombardi is the same. I think we have maybe Stamper on here. No, this is the defensive lineman award. Never mind. Either way, linebacker Stamper finished sixth there. Then he got the Thorpe Award. Givens finished fifth. Not bad for a true freshman. The rest of these guys are a bunch of older dudes. And Bale finished ninth. Then he got the Groza Award. Pepper finished sixth. Pretty neat there. Punter, we didn't have anybody on here. Uh, returner, we had Givens on here, but he finished 10th. Looks like a kid from Purdue won, or oh, NC State won that one. And last but not least, we won the Coach of the Year award. Let's go to All-Americans. It's going to be an interesting list. So we got two first-teamers, and both of them are coming back next year, which is insane. Aaron Stuckey and Larry Williams both holding those two spots. I don't think we'd have anybody else on the first team, but apparently we do. Ryan Stamper, I guess he's done enough to get that honor. So we got three first-team All-Americans on the list. Let's look at the second team. We may have somebody else on here. I don't... Yeah, oh, wow. So we got Givens as a second-team All-American. And Jonathan Bale, this just really surprised me. Was there no other free safety out there that could get more tackles and interceptions? I guess not. So he just played his part. And I didn't even control him hardly at all this year, which is really interesting. Then you go to the freshman All-American list. Of course, there is Stucky. Now... Uh, Givens would be the only one. Yes, yeah, so Givens made the uh, freshman All-American team. We can go over to the Conference USA list and see what we got. We got a bunch of dudes on here. Stucky, Williams, Gidros, Batiste, and Wright. And uh, let's see, Stamper and Givens and Bale, then our Pepper. <laughs> Bale Pepper. <laughs> so we got one, two, three, four... What, uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine first-team All-Americans. That's what happens when you go undefeated in a little small conference like that, I guess. You go to the second team. There's Cooper, made the second team. Then you got our center and Stevens, a guard, and Parenton. Both of our starting defensive ends made the list. Wow. Then we got Sanders, a corner, holding the strong safety. So one, two, what, three, four, five, six, seven, Seven and nine, so what, 16 all-conference players. Just incredible. Uh, just, I don't know if I've had that many. And I, again, I know we're playing in a smaller conference, but still 16? That's insane. Whew. Okay, exciting stuff. Let's go to bowl games. I don't want to look at this entire list. I just want to go all the way down here. Yes, we're playing uh, Michigan in the Sugar Bowl today. Then we got Oklahoma and Louisville, Auburn, Miami, and then UCLA and Virginia Tech in the bigger bowls, uh, Florida, Purdue, in the Capital One Bowl. Now let's go, uh, uh, Players of the Week actually isn't going to matter all that much in that conference, so I'm, I'm going to skip that. So let's check out the team info screen. Here we are. We're completely healthy. Stucky, 33 total touchdowns, only three interceptions, just an incredible ratio. Got the 3,000 yards. Williams is now averaging over 100 yards a game. Cooper doing his thing. Then on the defensive side, Stamper, Nixon, and Stamper again. Stamper just had a, an incredible season for us at outside linebacker. Now let's go over to the Big Ten. 
If I can get to it and look at Michigan, they have a cornerback out for the season. Looks like their starting quarterback is putting up good numbers. They got a running back averaging 116 yards a game. Looks like they got a wide receiver averaging 110 yards a game. So I'm guessing those guys really carry the load for them. Then you got on the defensive side. Uh, three guys just kind of doing their normal thing. It looks like in their last game, they did beat their big rival, Ohio State, 20 to 10. Whew, okay, I think we're ready to take on Michigan. It's just really weird. Am I actually saying this? I, I, don't, I don't know what to think about it, but let's go ahead and we're going to speed this up, get through that, and then, uh, like I said, they run a West Coast offense. I know how to prepare for that, but we're going to look at their roster, see where their impact players are at. Then we're going to work off of that. Oh my gosh, it's insane. So I don't know, is this is this a good thing or a bad thing for my dynasty to I mean, get to the title game this quickly? I, I don't know. We just looked at and had a bunch of teams lose. All right, so here we are. I am going to be in our Stormtrooper white look. And with Michigan, they are going to wear their classic stuff. Now, I think, nope, they just got the home and away. Now, I'm pretty sure with the next guys, you could probably put their blue uh pants on there if you wanted to but in the game currently they only got a home and away and no alternates so we're gonna come over here and let's take on the wolverines in the national title game again that makes no sense but somehow we snuck in there thanks to i guess a bunch of teams just not playing well enough and us just playing as good as football as you can ask for so yes i want to win i just don't know how to react after that if we do with the series i don't know we'll figure that out all right we are playing in the sugar bowl and guess what it's a home game <laughs> this is ridiculous makes it oh um, i just can't i mean we played our conference title game here we're gonna play our national title game here this is our home field it's just it's like the perfect setup for tulane and speaking of kudos to those uh, Green Wave uh, had just an incredible season this year. Willie Fritz, their head coach, beating USC in the bowl game. Just incredible. All right, here come the Michigan Wolverines, number one in the country. And here comes the number two team in the country, the Tulane Green Wave. Oh, my gosh. So first uh, in the conference and first in the country in the uh, rushing touchdowns. I guess that's another reason why he got a couple of rewards this year. All right, who are they going to pick? <laughs> He's picking us to win. That's just ridiculous. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, they won the toss, and they will get the ball first, which is fine. And let's check out their roster, see if we can find any holes. Starting quarterback, Jason Forcier. I hope I said that correctly. Got 78 speed. I still may go after him some today. Uh, they don't have an impact halfback. Thank the Lord that's going to help. Now, this guy's a bit of a load. 5'9", 231 pounds. He's still really talented, but he got 88 and 82 behind him. Fullback, 84 with 70 speed. His backup. I'd like to have that kid at 80 speed. Then 80 uh, wide receiver, uh, Doug Dutch. Great name. Impact player. This tells me they're going to throw the ball some, I would think. 94, 90, 91, 86. Maybe the best wide receiving core in the country. Definitely the best we've went up against so far. Uh, tight end, impact guy. So you know they're going to throw a lot today. 85 overall, 74 speed. He could definitely catch. You look at their offensive line, 84, 87, 94, 88, and 88. Really solid across the board. Now, they run, if I'm not mistaken, a 3-4. I think it's a 3-4. We'll find out quickly. Um, 88 and 88 on both ends. Then he got 92 at defensive tackle. 94 is his backup. So just a really solid front four slash front three, if, again, if they run the 3-4. You look at their linebackers, impact guy, 95 overall, maybe the best linebacker we'll face all season. Sean Crable, 84 speed. I'd love to have that kid. Then you got 85 and 76 and 78 middle linebacker and a 92 at right outside linebacker. So their outside linebackers are incredible. You look at their corners, 87, 85, 76 and 80. I guess this is a bit of a weakness. This guy's out. So that's not going to be a drop off for them. But they got speed outside of this guy right here. He's an 88. But still, really good talent there. 87 of free safety, 90 of strong safety. So their biggest weakness on defense, I guess, is their corners, their backups, maybe. So this tells me we're probably going to run anything and everything. 
there's really not anything I can pick at. Because, like, they're, I mean, their worst starter is, like, an 85. And that may be their middle linebacker. Or the corner. Wow, just really talented. By far the most talented defense we've faced this year. All right, kicker, true freshman, 78 overall. They've been recruiting really well. Then he got an 80 overall at punter. All right, let's get this show on the road. Let's play in the national title game. Why not? All right, they got a right uh, impact guy on the right side. I'm going to kick it over here, and I kicked it too far. And they're going to get great field position out of the gate. I kicked, I hit the button too late on the last one. That happens all the time. It's tough. It's quick. Let's just pretend they had a really good return. I am, uh, let's do a zone blitz. We're going to do a lot of zone today just because of, I think they're going to pass a ton. Maybe I can do something like this. Let's see what they go with. Play action. Off the back foot, intercepted. First play of the game, Holden with an interception. We came off with the blitz. Just incredible play by Stamper. I couldn't get the sack, but I forced him to throw it off his back foot, and it was all she wrote after that. Just a great play by Holden. That's a good start. Let me go, and uh, they may show us a good replay as well. Let's see. And that's okay. Either way, great interception. Let's go and make one adjustment. Let's do that, and let's start off with, uh, let's go tight end dig. From gun normal. They're going man dime. Got several options here. They're double teaming him. They're going cover zero out of the gate. Go to Gidros. Get it, son. Get it. Oh, he dropped it. All right, straight up dropped it. Okay, uh, second and 10. Man 3 4. So they are a 3 4 defense. We're going to run basic option on this one. I had to pitch that out quick, really quick. I thought I was fixing to get hit in the backfield. You saw it here. Somebody came right on through. This linebacker blitz. Yeah, I would have got hit in the backfield if I had to pitch that quickly enough. First and 10. Let's go. Uh, let's go gun spread. And let's try a halfback screen. Man dime will go to somebody on the left. Cover one. Gidros, at least he caught it this time. Great broke tackle by Gidros. He made up for it on that last play. So it is uh, first and 10 on the left hash. Let's call. Tunnel screen. Zone 3 4. We're going to go back to Gidros. Set up in the gun. Good defense. Nobody picked up that corner. So that makes it what? Second and 11? We'll go P. Reed. Zone nickel. I will probably. Uh, let's just do something like this. We'll just go to. Go to Williams to get about four or five yards there. And that makes it third and six. What are we going to call here? We will probably go. Oh, wide receiver curls. Go, man. They went, man. Whew. Now, they're blitzing that guy, so this may not work. I don't know who's going to be on him. But we're going to try to bounce this over to Williams really quick. Ooh, he's wide open. Good deal. We're going to get six points, and that's a great way to start the national championship. Nice. Thankfully, the free safety was on Williams, so we're going to get six points out of that. So let's kick an extra point. Let's go up seven. Well, wow, my mind, I don't know, my mind's just in a different place right now. I'm just not, I didn't, I didn't expect this. I know everybody knew who was going to play off the, uh, the thumbnail, I guess, what I'm going to use in the title of the video. I may change that up or something, but this was just the first time me seeing this. Huh, okay. Let's breathe, let's breathe. Got to kick it off right here. Try to do it better than last time. Really good kickoff here. Much better than the last one. Let's see if we can do something to that offense again. Uh, they are going to... Uh, let's go quarters. Again, I'm going to be playing a ton of zone today. I think they're going to pass, pass, pass. I hope they do. 
went basic run here, went halfback read, pick up five yards, maybe six. We're going to, uh, we can try zone blitz again. Let's take a look at how these guys have done on offense so far this year. Well, they've done pretty well. Uh, do something like this. These guys have been putting on an offensive clinic. Please don't run up the middle. And they ran up the middle. And somebody make a tackle. Going to get a first down there. That's two straight runs. They're going four wide. We'll go nickel out of quarters. Do something like this. I got a lot of field to cover. He's wide open. Make a tackle. Williams had to come over to make the tackle. That makes it, what, second and five. I'm going to go do a zone blitz from nickel. See if we can get little Anthony Gibbons on this guy. We're going to flip that, do something like this. Hopefully this will help. Good pickup on the blitz. There he goes. The quarterback can run it, and I think he's going to get a first down. I still want to go after this guy. I don't mind it. Let's go quarters. I want to keep blitzing just to kind of get him off his game a little bit. I'm going to be forced to turn over the first time. Went halfback dive. Good call. Against my quarters. Uh, we can try man this time. But second of inches, they can call about anything at this point. Ace. No, oh, they're doing. I don't know what they're going to call. They're going to the quarterback. Oh, make a play. Ah, oh, not you. Good catch by Mario Manningham. Just a good catch. I thought Sanders was going to pick that off. He tried, but just couldn't get there. Okay, let's go quarters out of nickel. Do something like this. Looks like we're going ace bunch. And he's going to run with it. Want to get eight yards. Uh, I'm going to go quarters out of 4-3. Looks like we're going to do an over front. Pullback dive. Didn't expect that. And almost got the touchdown. So it looks like they are on the verge of scoring. Well, let's go. Go line dog blitz. Uh, we're going to flip that. Hopefully I've done that correctly. And easy run. Just like that, they're going to tie it up. A very easy drive for them. They didn't have any issues. We couldn't stop. I don't remember stopping one decent run play either. That was a good answer for them. So we're going to got to get back on offense and get that touchdown back. They're really talented. And that quarterback is just fast enough to kind of do things. He already has, what, two broken plays there? One for a first down, another one was like for eight yards. He may have ran three times. Uh, we're going to let that one go. They don't have any weakness on the back end, so I'm going to run cross up like normal. They're going man 3-4. I hope they don't go goal line. Not a big fan of that shift. We're going to do something like this, but they're not going to do a spy. Good deal. I'm just going to run it. Get a good gain with Stucky. Good play there. Uh, we can try. What haven't I called? Um, I think what we may end up doing. I'm going to get a little creative here. Let's go triple wide receiver option. We're going zone dime. Oh, gosh. I'm definitely going to just hand this one off. Nowhere to go, though. Good job by their front four. Second and nine. I think I may just stay here. We're going to run basic option. Man, three, four. Got to be careful. I want to go to the right side. Just somebody came through. I don't know how, but I guess they blitz. Both guys blitz in that angle. My center got beat badly. And now it's third and forever. Third and what? 12? Third and 11? Uh, I guess we got no choice but to go tight and cross. And they're going man. Hmm. 
I don't know if this will help or not. I'd love to try to do a, like a rollout. And they're not going to let me do it. Make a play, Cooper, or not. Just a good stop by the defender. And just like that, we got a punt. Good defense across the board. Just really had nowhere to go on that one. They got an impact guy back there. I will probably high kick this thing. What worries me, though, is he's got time to make a move, but thankfully I got to him in time. So now Michigan gets back on offense. We're going to go here. Do something like this. I almost feel like I'm TCU. <laughs> I know TCU is a power five team, but TCU going up against Georgia, that's kind of what it feels like. Another dive. Ah, oh, ow. He just broke the tackle. I didn't do anything goofy there. He just broke it. Uh, let's try a zone blitz, maybe. Hopefully this guy doesn't stay in the block. I hope they pass. He stayed in the block. Somebody stop him. I'm going to get about five, six yards there. So I may need to back off the blitz. And he is kind of running away pretty much from every one of them. Let's go quarters out of 4-3. Second and seven. I'm going to do something like this. We'll do an over front. Going to pass. Somebody got a hand on us, so that makes it, what, third and eight? Third and seven. We're going to go cloud. I'm going to control Nixon. Man, if we can get a stop here, that'd be great. Please pass it. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, no, no. Yep, play. Hold it. Wow, great play. I could have swore that was going to be an instant gain for them. He made the catch, but Holden came right on in there and got in the way. Whew, that was a huge play. So we're on the 47. We're going to do an all-out block. This is a perfect area for them to not come in to protect. We're going to do something like this. Maybe we can get lucky and come on through. Get it! Oh, man. Somebody should have jumped up for that one. We're going to fair catch that one. So what we're going to do, I'm going to go... I'm just going to try this. We're going to go halfback dive. Since they're going 3-4, I'm going to see if I can try to attack the middle in that 3-4 front, or that 3-down front. Nothing. Just Wow, their off defensive line is killing it. Somebody just came right on through. My center is getting destroyed by that defensive tackle. Like, it's not even close. Okay, nine seconds. Uh, I'm going to try Let's go slot cross. I don't think I got time for it. No, I don't. All right, that is end of the first quarter. Seven to seven. It is just deadlock. But I think we've gained one extra possession, so I think we're still okay. Let's go back to slot cross. Looks like we're going to have to stay away from that front. They are killing it with that regard. Looks like they're going cover one. I'm going to come over here. Good catch back. Cooper, did we get a first? Did we get it? 30 inches. Oh, we didn't. Let's go wide receiver curls. We're going man dime. I am. I'm going to keep this simple. We'll just go to Williams and just get the first down. I think that's a good idea. Now what I'm going to do is we're going to give him the ball. We're going to go basic dive. Oh, I just now forgot. Probably not a good idea to go up against that front, but we'll see what happens here. They are going man nickel. And that guy shifted over. What we can do is something like this. Give us some simpler numbers to work with. Wow. Look at that. We're just not getting anywhere. Nobody picked up that linebacker. My defensive line, or my offensive line is just playing terrible football at the moment. They're just getting beat so badly. So we are in the middle of the field, right? Is that correct? Kind of, sort of. Uh, we could try deep cross up again. It didn't work the last time. We're going zone. Let's see if we can. Oh, wow. He beat him badly. Terrible throw. Awful. Just not a good play at all. So we got uh, third and forever. Oh, man. They're just playing killer defense. Man. They're doing that. Uh, I wonder. 
I think I'm going to do something really crazy here. Oh, they went spy again. They went spy. And this was, uh, this is, yeah. Oh! <laughs> that was stupid. Don't ever do that. They keep, they are really smart on those third downs. They're going QB spy on me. But somehow Cooper makes the catch of the year. I just don't, I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't see anybody else open. I was, my whole plan was to run to the left and try to pick up a first down with Stucky. But no, they went triple spy. Just just ridiculous. I mean, great play call on their part. But we just got lucky on this one. He just made a killer catch against four dudes. I mean, I don't know what you say about that. But just an insane play right there. Incredible. Oh, okay. So the drive is still alive? I don't know. So what we're going to have to do, I don't know if our run game is going to have a whole lot of luck. We're going to start have, passing some more. We're going to go man. Uh, they're going man. We're going to go with the halfback screen. They're going to cover one at least. Cover. Uh, wow, what a great defense. And he drops it. Again, Gidros. Look at that. Just perfect blitz. Insane blitz. Poor Gidros. He's dropped two passes already. I had a comment from somebody a couple days ago saying, hey, my guys drop passes all the time. Well, I mean, mine do too, apparently. I don't, what do you do about it? Um, it happens. You got college kids to deal with. Let's try halfback direct. Is that going to help anything? They're going zone dime. I'm, we're going to have to do a lot of outside runs, I think. Good block right there. Get a first down with Williams. Uh, we can try. Let's stay here. Let's go wide stick. We're going zone. Red zone, number. Red zone. We will probably go to somebody over the middle. Away with four go to right. Good catch. Not a very good throw. Uh, we can stay here and go speed option. Zone dime. We got to be very careful on this one. I'm going to go to the left. Get up the field. Oh, so close. Stucky. So that is what third and two i would love to just hand the ball off i don't know if he can get it <laughs> let's we'll try it i just want to try to give the ball to stucky they're going man five two interesting which is essentially like a three four Ooh, good deal i didn't know what was going to happen there so another touchdown for the heisman trophy winner you go back and look at that i thought we, somebody was going to get beat right there but I just was patient enough, and thankfully our fullback got a good block, or tight end got a good block, and we got six points out of it. So now we are up a touchdown. Let's see if we can stop Michigan. We've stopped them twice. They scored a touchdown once. Let's see what they do on this next drive. Just incredible. Now, again, I am playing on max sliders. And I have a chance to win a national championship with a B-minus team. So I don't know what to think about. I, I just don't know how to feel about that. This will be both well-received by those who just enjoy the series and shunned by some others. Great tackle by somebody. Saved a touchdown there. Let's go quarters. They've been more balanced than I've expected, but I'm still kind of leaning towards the pass. For now, I like to bait this guy to another pick, but they're going another off tackle. Great run, Killer. Their running back's playing great. They're picking their spots well. I'm gonna try zone blitz. I hope this works. I'm kind of bunched up here. I don't know what's gonna happen. Oh, get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him. I had to wrap all the way around just to go make the tackle. Second and three. They're going with a big set. I can't run a four. four. Can I do a four four? I don't think I can. Uh, I don't think I got the middle linebacker for it. I'm pretty sure I don't. I can't believe I already forgot this. I kind of can if I felt like it. No, I don't want to do that. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick with just my basic coverage against run. I'm okay with that. Oh, they're going two wide anyways, so it doesn't matter. It said they was going one wide receiver. Oh, he almost got out of that. 
Good stop. So this guy is running all over the place. Third and four. I'm going to go cloud. I am going to control this guy. We're going to do a spy. Oh, they're going to just run up the gut. That's smart. And there he goes. I just, what do you do? They're just tough. That's a really good running back. Look at his average. Averaging almost 12 yards of carry at the moment. Let's go nickel man. Do something like this. Get him, get him, get him sacked. Yeah, finally got to him. Ooh, and he's hurt. That's just his chest. That's usually not a big injury. It's usually, I'd be shocked if he doesn't come back. Now they're back up. Ooh, I think they're going to run. No, no, we're going to try his own blitz. It's second and 15. They probably need to pass it. I'm quite positive their backup quarterback can't run. 59. Yes, that's what we... Let's go after that guy if we can. The Wolverine. Go with the Don't run up the left. And that's exactly what they did. Good play call first thing. Look at that. He wins. That's the perfect play call against that defense. Okay, I guess we're going to go back to man since they're just dedicated to running the ball. So their play calling has been really good. I just wasn't expecting them to run as much as they have been. Now they decide to pass. Great catch, but that's out of bounds. Second and 10. We're going to go quarters out of zone, or quarters out of nickel. Going back to ace bunch. I got a lot of responsibility here over the middle. Hopefully they pass it. Basic run. Open field tackle by myself, third and four. Oh, my gosh. What do we do? I'm going to do something really weird. We're going to do a crash three. This is a cover three blitz beater. And they're doing that. Ooh, I'm going to call a timeout. I don't like that. It said they was going three wide. Oh, gosh. What do we do? I'm, oh, man. I think they're going to run it. Let's just go cover two, man. Maybe we can go hat on a hat here. Now it says they're going one wide receiver. I hate when it does that. All day to throw. Oh, great defense. Force the field goal. Force the field goal. How about that? So there's a minute 12 to go. Can we get the ball back, go down the field, and score before half? We're going to try. Let's see what happens. Miss it. Now, he's a pretty decent kicker. He's a true freshman. Ooh, he barely made it. That was close. So it's 14 to 10. Really tight game. Very entertaining so far. A lot of back and forth. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Minute nine. Let's see if I can go down the field try that again. We're going to go here with Batiste. No blocking. Right hash. I got to get down the field somewhat. So we're going to go back to that slot cross play. I hope they go zone. And their starting quarterback is out for the game. We got to take advantage of that. We got to. Now we can blitz that dude to uh, kingdom come. Let's get around. This ain't good. Oh, intercepted. Great defense. Just my left tackle could not get a beat on that dude right there. I had to run for my life. I had to throw it off my back foot. Second and 10, I got to be very careful here. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to run the ball. That kind of forces me out from not trying to get super aggressive. Unless we could get a big gain here. Now they are, oh, I don't like any of that. I have to pitch that out quick. And we got out of bounds too. So it's third and five. Oh, gosh. Uh, we're going to go tight end dig. They're going zone. This is super risky. Just in terms of, I don't know if we'll get it. I don't think we're going to get that. No, I got to call a timeout. That's not enough yardage. So what I'll probably do, I'm going to try this again. We're going to go back that slot cross. Maybe we can make it work this time. They're going zone dime. Our left tackle needs to play great here. Now, I'm not a big fan of that shift. <laughs> that doesn't help things. All right, we got more time to throw. Great play, great play, great play. Sack punt, sack it to the Cooper. Ha! Ah. We finally made it work. Great throw by Stucky. And all he had left was to beat that safety. Incredible. 
insane play. So Cooper, who's kind of been an unsung hero this year, but has been very quiet because of Stucky and Williams is getting all the love. But he's having a great game so far, that's for sure. Just like that, 20 to 10. That was a huge swing right there. Oh, I'm glad I called that play again. I knew we'd make it work eventually. So they got 46 seconds. Can they go down the field and score? With their backup quarterback, he's pure pocket passer. I don't know if they just want to run the rest of the way. We'll see. Uh, we will go here. I'm going to kick it to the left. Do something like this. Good. Uh, he's got some room to work with and plenty of grass to boot. And just like that, they scored a touchdown. What in the world happened there? Wow. I mean, just did my guy just not decide to tackle him? Like, right. I don't know what 47 was doing. But right there, he just thought, nope, you're just not close enough. Oh, well, that was a good answer for him. We've given up several of those this year. There's no real trick to, or secret to try to stop him that other than get. Got, everybody has to get in good position to make a tackle. I don't know. My guys decided not to on that one. So now we're just up four. 37 seconds. We got one timeout left. Can we go down the field and score again? We may have to do more swing routes and uh, rollouts and whatnot. Let's see if Batiste can get us down the field a little bit. Good cut right there. Get it to the 30. We're on the 33, uh, 33 seconds. Uh, what are we going to call? Let's go. I don't know. Uh, I may go back to that again. Uh, we can flip the... Uh, I, I'm really worried about this. Let's go tight end cross. They're going man. I'm actually okay they're going that. Zone, I didn't really want... And they're going cover. Cover zero. Get it, Batiste. Get it. Get it. Oh, what a great catch. I got to call a timeout, though. Now we're out of timeouts. I didn't get out of bounds. Great catch by Batiste. Great throw by Stucky. We need... Let me see. What do we need? We need to... Let's go half back out. They're going zone. I'm going to go to Decray. Hopefully we can get out of bounds on this one. Get out of bounds at the face mask. Call it. Thank you. An extra five yards. That's a gift. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Uh, that's going to be a five-yarder. And my coach just died. Uh, first and... It's first and one ten. If they run the 23, we need to get out of bounds. Let's keep doing more. Uh, let's go. Where's that? Halfback screen. They're going man. Unfortunately, we could probably get the first down. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> On the four-yard line. Okay, so what we're going to do, I hope I'm doing this correctly. Tidy a uh, tunnel screen. They're going man. Yes. 5-2. Yes. Maybe we can get another touchdown. We're going to do something like this. We're going to go to little Anthony Gibbons, the little engine that can for six points. Ah. Yeah. 27-17, son. Get you some. Wow, that was a great drive. I was not expecting to get down the field that quickly, but we just made plays. Whew, wow. What a wild last minute. Now, they, there's 13 seconds left. They may take it back to the house, so what I may end up doing is high-kicking this next one to prevent that. Let's kick the extra point first. Ooh, I may have missed it. Nope, right down the middle. Oh, my gosh. Insane. This, this entire situation... It's just insane. So let's high kick this thing. That gets them 13 seconds to play with. I think they'll just run out the clock at that point. I do not want that guy to return it again. They're going to fair catch it. From there, are they going to try? They're going four wide. They may just try to get down the field quickly for a Hail Mary situation. Uh, we're going to do something like this. They're not going Hail Mary. Third, it's too early for that. To the air on first down. Nobody open over there. Oh, he should have. Get it, 
<laughs> the true freshman. True freshman. True freshman. All American. Anthony Given. Two straight touchdowns for the freshman. Ah. Wow, what a great play by Anthony Givens. He tipped it. Insane. Oh, and we forced the interception, honestly, with that force pressure. Oh, my gosh. That may be another. Uh, let me go. I may have to get a thumbnail for this one. Just insane. I don't know which one to go with. We'll have to do something like this. Something like maybe like that may be a really good one. Just incredible. Just in a, I mean, what an incredible performance by that guy right there. I mean, geez. And we're up 30. We're going to hang, what, 70 on this team? I don't know. I don't know what to think about any of it. I mean, I'm happy we're winning. Just It's like the greatest season I could ever hope for for this team. So there's three seconds. Can they go down the field and score again? I'm going to high kick it again. I'm not going to give up that chance to have them go down the field with an, another return. So we've scored how many points this last minute? Last two minutes, three touchdowns? I think they may be going Hail Mary. Is this the Hail Mary? It is the Hail Mary. So I'm going to go way after him. This is the Hail Mary play. They're going to try it. Don't know if this kid's got a good enough arm for it. Moore drops back on first down. He's looking. Let's and he can. Somebody be smart. Shoo! Okay, end of the first half, and we're up 35 to 17. I let's just look at some stats. So we got almost 300 yards of offense. We're not running the ball all that well, but our passing game's killing it. Uh, their passing game is not. Ever since their quarterback went down, they haven't been the same since. Our third downs have been a whole lot better than theirs. They got two turnovers. That's another reason why we're up so high. Let's go to individual stats. Stucky, 13 of 18, 30 touchdowns, no interceptions, playing incredible football. Williams, your Heisman winner, only 42 yards on the ground and one touchdown, but he's got three receptions for 19 yards and a touchdown. So he's been in the end zone twice. Cooper's been in once. Givens has been in twice, on, both on special teams and through the air. You look on defense, everybody and their brothers spreading the wealth on the tackle front. You go to tackles for loss. Nixon and Shive Sams are two starting defensive ends. And he got two sacks by those guys. And interceptions, Givens and Holden. Just an overwhelming experience at the moment. I'm trying to still kind of put it all together. And we get the ball back. Just ridiculous. Middle of the field. Maybe we can get deep cross up to work again. Or have we gotten to work at all yet? I don't think we have. Uh, maybe we had one decent run. I'm going to go after him. I don't care. This is the national championship game. Uh, ew, okay, I'm going to have some room to play with. Good throw. Right where it needs to be to Cooper, who again is having an incredible game. Already has 164 yards through four catches. Uh, let's go. We can try QB choice. Zone nickel. Uh, don't shift hard to the left or do so. How about that? Uh, I'm going to keep it. Get a block right there. Going to get some yards out of that. Not bad. Not a bad play for, for Stucky. Uh, we'll stay here. And I will probably... Is Because my PA read, can it work on the right hash? Yes, it can. Let's do it off the right hash. I'm so used to doing it off the left. Go on man nickel. Who's on who? Looks like he is on him, so I think I'm going to hand this one off. Ooh, they went cover zero. That's okay. I think Williams is going to get some yards out of this one. Get a first down there. And he broke their all-time rushing record for a single season at the school. Just another thing added to his legend, I guess. We are on the left hash. What haven't we called? We haven't done... I haven't done anything from this formation. I want to try. Let's get fancy. Let's go. If I can get to it, where's that? Triple wide receiver option. They're going man three. Ooh, they're shifting super hard that way. Uh, we're going to try. I 
he dropped it, but he got it back, thankfully. So we lost yards on that one. Second and forever. We're going to have to go down the field somewhat on this one. Let's go halfback angle. Let's flip it. They're going man, and they're blitzing some dudes. This is going to go probably, I think they're going to cover zero. Let's go to the tight end. How about that for a second point? No, he's going to get beat. Ah, that's intercepted. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And then Stucky broke the all-time record for a single season in passing touchdowns. So I caught that somehow. I don't know. I'm not supposed to. I thought he was going to get that picked off. He overshot it a little bit, but I think he rent off his back. It's just one of those games. I don't know. Let's go over here and look. I think he hit off. I think the ball went off that dude's back. He dropped it. <laughs> just more goofiness in a good way. I don't know. So I, I don't know. I, I'm really curious to see what the response is going to be like in the comment section for this game, for this dynasty. This may be my going out party with 06, and I just may even want to move on to another game or something. I don't know. Just in terms of dynasty stuff, I don't know. I just feel like I can't do any better. Does that make sense? I can't make things any more magical than what I've done with this dynasty. Yes, we had an easier road, but we just snuck into the title game. There's nothing you can do about that. Just whatever. <laughs> Craziness. 42 to 17. Uh, let's go zone blitz. We're going to go here. I'm going to flip it. I'm going to come right here. He might be playing too cautious out there. I just intercepted him. <laughs> what the? Again, did we blitz him quick enough? Is that what happened? Who is he throwing to? He had plenty of protection. Nope. I, he threw it. It's a corner route, and he threw it way too early, I guess. Just a terrible throw. First, I just... <laughs> that, we'll take it. <laughs> All right, so let's try. I have an idea. I'm going to go PA rollout. Let's do plenty of action. We're going zone. Please go cover two. That would be great. Cover two. What a throw! What a throw by the true by the true freshman. Insane! Look at this throw. It's right where it needed to be. That's why I called that play. I wanted to hit him over the top. Uh, so I don't. What are we gonna call? Uh, let's go. Let's get the ball. Let's go to Williams if they're gonna let us. Nope, they're going man. So we're gonna go to somebody on the left. Looks like they're going at least cover one. I don't think we got enough room to go over the top. Looks like we don't have to bother with that. We'll just go over to Gidros. Get about four or five yards. A seven yard pickup. Seven yards. A whole lot more than I expected. Let's go PA Reed. Man 5-2. That's a hard shift. I will probably just go over here. Ooh, he picked his own player. Bring us six points. <laughs> Insane. Hit the linebacker. Got picked by his own defensive end right there. Do you see him? He got stuck right there. And I was able to get open with Williams for another touchdown. Why not? That's just the way it's gone today. Just whatever. <laughs> so I, I, this will probably disappoint people, and I kind of get it. We shouldn't be destroying this team like we are, but we're just playing just incredible football. I don't get it. Just... Uh, Again, max sliders, uh, maybe that hidden momentum meter that some people think is in here is really taking effect. I don't know. It was tight for a while, then we just kept making better plays. Let's kick it back off. Just ridiculous. We're going to get our second string in here. That's coming back. Wow, everything that can go wrong is for them. We're going to accept that. Let's go quarters out of 4-3. Like so this is what it looks like when you win a national title with a team that's really not supposed to. This is it right here. It, it can happen. That's a good run there. I'm going to go back to quarters this time from nickel. We'll do something like this. 
kind of a pseudo 4-3 look. Up the gut, somebody got to stop. Face mask. That's a five-yarder. Should be a five-yarder, and it is. So that makes it what? Oh, it makes it automatically first and ten. Let's do a zone blitz. Maybe we can get little Anthony Givens after this guy. We'll do something like this. It's like we got both guys coming off the outside. Nope, halfback dive or direct. Going to give a five yards on that one. I am. Uh, let's go a quarter out of four three. I'm not going to blitz on this one. Going, I think those are their two tight ends in there. Ooh, play action. Good throw. Get a first down there. That's his first completion on the day. They're back up. Now we'll go back to quarters. It said they was going. I hate when it does that. It said they was going too wide to get the here of the yard. Nice bunch. Going to get about five yards there. Who made the tackle? I think that was Anthony Givens. Just ridiculous. What an incredible player. So if we win, and it looks like we're going to, does that mean I have no choice but to get invited to the SEC? You you would think so, or somebody. Go to some Power 5 car. We can't stay in Conference USA doing this. He broke the tackle. You know, does that make sense? So I'll figure that out what to do there. But we can't stay in Conference USA after the day. There's no way. It wouldn't make sense. What conference wouldn't take us at this point? I went triple option on that play. That wasn't expecting that. We'll go back to quarters. Do something like this. Just insane. This entire season, what a just, just magical is the best word I could come up with for it. I'm going to go, let's try another zone blitz. Maybe we can get to him this time. Hopefully they'll pass it. Do something like this. I haven't had a really good luck getting after this guy with Givens yet. Good pick up on the blitz. Interception. He caught it. Ha! I think he tipped it to him. So it looks like they're going to score a touchdown here. And uh, they're going that. Let's just go go on. So do I need to I don't need to worry about clock or anything, do I? Just an easy touchdown there. That's gonna make it 49 to 23. We are up 26, gonna go up 25. Um, I will run some clock the rest. I mean, I don't know. I mean, anything can happen, I guess. I don't, I don't think they're good enough to come back. I, I guess they are. If anybody can do it, I guess they can. I mean, there's still a full quarter left. I say let's just keep scoring touchdowns and not worry about it. I can still run clock along the way. I can't believe I'm saying that I'm going to run clock against Michigan. To try to win this thing. Get through it. Oh, I couldn't get through I'm going to go, we got some room to work with. Let's go here. I'm going to go back to that halfback screen. They've called man every time I've ran this play. So we'll go to somebody on the left. Looks like they're going at least cover one. And they're going cover zero. Let's go to Cooper. Make a play. <laughs> he caught that. Wow, what a play. And he, Stucky broke the... He broke some record. I don't know which one it was. It's the passing yards. So he broke the passing touchdown and yards in the same game. Wow, that's insane. Good for him. Good for you, Stucky. True freshman. Wasn't expecting you to do much of anything this year, but just kind of keep the boat flowing. Ooh, none of that looks good. I'm going to do something. Just get down. I'm not going to get hit. There's no point in it. Good defense. Second and 16. Uh, we can try. Do I? Uh, let's do Y. Let's do corners. Second and long. We're going zone nickel. We'll go to either Batiste or Williams. 
Tulane. I'm actually going to let that clock run out. I'm okay with that. All right, end of the third quarter. We are five minutes away from winning the national championship game, which is insane, but looks like we're on our way to doing that. So it is second and 16. Let's do speed option. Man nickel. Everybody and their brother's shifting that way. Let's bring this guy over. Something like this. Get a block there. Gidros. Didn't get the first, but we got a much more manageable situation. Third and one. I am going to go halfback screen. We're going to flip it. We're going man. We're going to go over to Batiste. Should be an easy first down. The clock has stopped, so we'll go ahead and snap this. High snap. And we're going to get six points. <laughs> he threw it off his back foot, and he broke the all-time passing touchdown record in a single game at the school. He's broken like three records today. It, he is. Lee Corso's right. He is having the game of his life. Insane. He had thrown off his back foot. We still got the touchdown. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Whew. Okay. We get, uh, maybe this could be our thumbnail. Something like... Have him just... I, I don't know. Just... I'm, I don't know what to say. <laughs> The whole thing is just overwhelming at the moment. I, I was coming into this video expecting to play like in the Rose Bowl or something because Oklahoma beat Colorado and they should have got ahead of us, but they didn't. They didn't. Which, one guy made a good comment. I forgot who it was. Oklahoma already has like three losses on the year, so I guess it's okay for them not to be in our spot at the moment. We're undefeated. Are we the only undefeated team in the country? I think we are. I mean, Michigan's got one loss. So that's probably right. That's how bad of a year it's been for a lot of these teams getting beat and such. Let's go 4-3 man cover two. Do I need to start putting in my second string? I, I Maybe I do. It's... Oh, my gosh. Let's see what we do here. Fullback dive. They've been running that stuff a ton today. And he just gets 20 yards on it. Maybe they need to keep running that. Let's go back to the same play. Ace normal. Something happened. Was it a false start? I couldn't tell who moved. And it is a false start. A lot of their penalties have went against them today. Concentration will push the offense back. Uh, yeah. Let's go nickel man. Watch someone. You gotta control that. First down and 15 to go. Ball on their own so we win our, and this is enough. We won our national championship in our on our home field. I mean, you can't write that any better. Got a big game there. Let's go 4-3 again. Second and five coming up here. They still got their first string out there. And the man at wideout is in a zone right now. Drops back to pass. He steps up. Somebody get him. Intercept that. He tried. So that is what? Third and something. I'm going to stay in man. They're going with a really big set, or supposedly they are. Do something like this. I think I may do it like a chop block move. Don't know if it helped or not. Intercepted. Oh, off. Almost got to it. So that is a first down. Uh, I'm going to try a zone blitz. We're going to do a little different. We're going to do a lightning two. It's first and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. I'll do something like this. Maybe I can they line up in an eye. get my defensive end going. Oh, they went toss. Oh, he still broke the tackle. And they still got the catch. <laughs> Just a lot of weird, goofy plays today. Let's go zone. Yeah, let's go quarters at a nickel. Do something like this. Oh, good catch. Good hit. I didn't get there in time, but I did make the tackle. 
Go quarters out of four three. They're running a lot of clock force, which it doesn't matter at this point. This game is over with. And a sack. Nixon got his second on the day. That makes what? How many does he have on the year? A bunch. Let's go cloud. If we can get the ball back, I'm going to put my second string in. I'm going to let our first string finish it out. And a sack. That's it right there. And we're going to get the ball right back. No, it's fourth and 16. I thought that was, I thought, thought well, it was fourth. My bad. Let's try this again. Fourth and forever. Let's see if Harris can get another sack. Off the back foot, make a play. And he didn't get it. <laughs> he didn't get it. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go put in our mass subs. We're going to do that. I'm going to go depth chart. I need to make one change. Let's put Sherman in for Williams. And it's first and down. And we're going to win. That's just, I don't, whatever. <laughs> we're going to win a national championship game. Oh, my gosh. Our first national title in year three. I was hoping. Oh, I, I didn't know what I was hoping for, honestly. Eh, I'm going to have to go to the outside. I went with a counter. Second and four, maybe. Uh, let's go here. Let's try. I'm going to try counter again. Now I'm just running clock. I'd like to get one more first fan. That would be great. They're doing... We can go over here. I don't know if that's going to help or not. The way that defensive line shifted outward. We may have to cut this one in at the B gap. Get down to a couple of seconds. Or just nobody picks that dude up. He blitzed inward. That is what, third and forever? Third and nine. I don't know if he can. I thought I had one play. And maybe in a different formation. That's it. It's compost stick. I forgot I had this play. We're going to flip it. They're going zone. I'm going to try to go to Cooper. He's still in the game. Uh, I can go to Kessler, too, depending on the coverage, but we need the first down. They're going cover two. Look at that throw. First down. Game over. <laughs> it was game over about an hour ago. But still, Chase Cooper, 242 yards. Insane. He's our, who's our MVP? Is it him? Is it Stucky? Is it Williams? I don't know. Is it Givens? Givens had two touchdowns. It's like just the perfect way to end the season. I don't want to end the dynasty. I don't know what, again, I don't know how I'm going to handle this, but what we are going to do is take a knee the rest of the way. Then we're going to look at some stats and then I'll let you go and then we'll all, we'll figure out what we're going to do with the rest of the dynasty afterwards. I'll have plenty of time to think about it. Gonna do that. We're gonna hurry it up. Two lane green wave. National champions. Again, I don't know the last time I won a national title with a group of five school. It's super hard. It's about next to impossible. You just gotta get lucky in the polls and such. Thankfully we had a tough schedule. I I, I spruced it up as best I could. And that looked like it worked out for us. It helps that we went on uh, went against number five Florida and beat them and things like that. I think we took on another top 15 team at the beginning of the season. I don't remember who that was, though. I've already forgot. Either way, there it is. 56 to 24? I, I, I can't wait to see what the reception is going to be for this video. I don't know. It's just either going to be really great or be like, all right, Al, you got to quit playing 06. You got to do something different. Somebody's going to say, we got to max out your sliders. Well, I kind of already done that. Uh, I don't know. We'll figure something out. There it is. National champions? Uh, okay. All right. That's cool. Yes. Uh, we, we won a national title. <laughs> Year three. And we're not, we, we, we weren't supposed to, but we did. 2008 national champions. A perfect 14 0. The greatest season I've ever had with a group of five school ever. I, I can't come close to what we just done today. Especially winning a national title, but just playing just solid across the board. Our defense was good. The offense was good. And we got, like, three starting seniors on the team. Only three. Like, that entire team that you just saw today is pretty much all coming back. Ridiculous. All right, let's look at the stats. 523 23 yards to their 307. 
We didn't run the ball a whole lot, but I guess we didn't have to because our passing game was so ridiculous. 438 yards. We didn't have any sacks. They had four. Our third down conversion was killer today. Seven of eight. Theirs got a little bit better. The turnovers was a big deal. We didn't have any. They had three. They really had no chance once their starting quarterback went out, though, I thought. Uh, let's look at the individual stats. Stucky, 20-25, 415 yards, six touchdowns, no interceptions. Look at the efficiency. Uh, it should be here somewhere, shouldn't it? Yes, the average, 16.6 .6 yards per throw, per attempt, per completion, I should say. That is just ridiculously efficient. Not a whole lot of uh, completion or attempts for the amount of yards he put up. Insane. So is he your MVP of the game? I didn't even say who they listed. Uh, either way, here's Williams. Only 78 yards rushing, only one touchdown off nine attempts, but he also had two receiving touchdowns. So he had three touchdowns total. Cooper had a touchdown. He had 242 yards off six receptions, 40.3 yards per reception. That's ridiculous. Batiste got a touchdown. Wright got a touchdown. Gidros is the only one who didn't, which surprised me. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Gibbons got a touchdown through the air. He got a uh, a pick six. I, I think I may have said special teams earlier, but he got a pick six. Just insane. Defensively, holding our strong safety led in tackles. Tackles for loss. Nixon with two. Harris and Shive Sams with one apiece. We end up with four sacks. And I thought our front four played a whole lot better than I expected, especially against an offensive line. We just made plays back there for sure. And you look at the box score. This was the key to the game was that second quarter, especially the last two minutes of the game. We were up, what, four points with about two minutes to go. And then we just put up like two quick touchdowns. And it was kind of all she wrote after that. We just put up more points than they did pretty much every single quarter. Oh my gosh, my head is hurting, but I had so much fun. Just an overwhelming experience. 14-0, national champions. And we may still not even get invited to the SEC or whoever may want to take us. Now, since it's going to advance to the next week, let's see what happens. And we're about to find out now. I don't... Uh, see, I forgot about this. It automatically forces you to go into the national... Or go into the offseason. All right, it says we won the Sugar Bowl. We won the national title. I do not want to accept any of those. We're going to decline all of those. I want to decline all of them. And no. And no. So there we go. So we didn't even get invited to a bigger conference, yet we are national champions. So I don't know what to make of that. I don't know if that means that I need to I, – I don't want to force my team into a bigger conference. I know you could go in the back end and do that. But I feel like we've kind of earned it at this point. But it's too late now. It would have already told us, hey, you're going to get invited to a big conference. It's not going to show it. And i got to save this file. So the only way I can get to a bigger conference next season is if I give somebody this file and they just change it up for me. Which, again, I really don't want to do that. So I don't know. Either way, national champions, I hope you enjoyed this season, this game. This dynasty may end it right here. I, I don't know what to do with it at this point because I don't know if – Going back and playing in the Conference USA again for another season is going to be fun for people. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll come, we'll come up with something. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.